Good job, Lottie. Doug Otani is here to help Lottie become someone's pet. He's a behavior modification specialist for the Oregon Humane Society. All this area that's being constructed. Doug and the rest of the staff will be able to help many more animals when they expand to a lot next door. Four additional acres for buildings to house new programs. So cool! I love it! Sharon Harmon is the president and CEO of the Oregon Humane Society. The $36 million construction is called the New Road Ahead the most ambitious expansion of OHS programs in its 153 year history. Making sure people have access to veterinary care for their pets to preserve families, and as well as going back to our roots, which is about confronting suffering and cruelty in all of its forms. OHS is getting a financial boost from the ASPCA. The American Society for the Prevention of Cruelty to Animals has given them a $1.75 million grant. The Oregon Humane Society has really, for a long time, been a national model. The new facility will be the first of its kind on the West Coast. It'll have a behavior rehabilitation and rescue center, a community teaching hospital, and an animal crimes forensic center. Is this a step trying to make more of a difference? Absolutely. We see these programs as that Oregon Humane Society is launching as really the future of animal welfare. It's an unfortunate thing that there's a need for investigation of, of animal crime. The evidence collected can help solve cases of animal abuse, cruelty, and neglect. Of the 2,500 cases brought to OHS in a year, as few as 50 actually go to a criminal court. This facility is often full with people and animals, um, trying our best to just make sure that everything can still happen in a, a safe and efficient way. The ultimate goal, to keep families together. Most of our work is focused on education, assistance, resources, getting them down from 50 cats to five. If you ask the kids, they don't want to give up the dog. So why are we creating the system that breaks apart families when we can do so much better? She's coming to me for comfort, uh, for protection. With Doug's help, Lottie has come a long way to being ready for a new family. With the Road Ahead expansion, OHS is looking forward to more success stories. Creating a more humane society. The two-legged, the four-legged, the feathered and the furred, they all matter. In Northeast Portland, I'm Stephen Redland, KGW News.